Hello and welcome back to our channel. If you're new here, don't forget to hit that subscribe button. Today we're embarking on a journey into the past, exploring the life of an iconic figure, Princess Diana. Known for her independent spirit and humanitarian work, Diana was no stranger to the harsh glare of the media spotlight. Her struggles were public, her pain palpable, and her resilience inspiring. Now, imagine if she were here today, witnessing her son, Prince Harry, making a bold move to America. Harry's decision, a bid for freedom from relentless media scrutiny, is a path many believe Diana would have passionately supported. After all, Diana was a woman who championed authenticity and the courage to follow one's heart, even when it meant breaking royal tradition. Today we dive deep into the heart of Princess Diana's legacy and how it could have influenced Harry's American dream. Princess Diana was no stranger to the relentless scrutiny of the media and the immense toll it can take on one's mental health. This was a woman who, in the face of constant public attention, fought valiantly for her freedom and privacy. She was all too familiar with the unyielding gaze of the press, their unending quest for scandal, and the relentless intrusion into her personal life. These struggles only served to fuel Diana's independent spirit, her desire to break free from the constraints and expectations of the royal institution. Diana's relationship with the media was fraught with tension. From the moment she stepped into the public eye, she was relentlessly pursued by the press. Yet she refused to be defined by their narratives. Instead, she sought to control her own story, to present herself as she truly was, not as the media wished to portray her. She spoke openly about her struggles with mental health, breaking the silence around an issue that was often stigmatized. She stood up against the pressures and expectations of the royal institution, demonstrating a bravery that was admired around the world. Her independent spirit was evident in the way she lived her life. Diana was not one to passively accept the status quo. She forged her own path, breaking away from royal tradition in various ways. She was hands-on with her sons, taking them to school and spending quality time with them, a stark contrast to the distant parenting style often associated with the royals. She used her platform to advocate for causes close to her heart, such as the fight against landmines, and did so with a passion and authenticity that was hard to ignore. This spirit of independence, this desire to live life on her own terms, was a defining aspect of Diana's character. It was this spirit that made her a beloved figure, not just in the United Kingdom, but around the world. Diana's experiences would have made her understand and empathize with Harry's decision more than anyone else. Her legacy of authenticity, compassion, and independent spirit lives on, reflected in the bold decisions of her sons. Prince Harry's decision to move to America was a bold one, a testament to his courage and his desire to prioritize his family's happiness and privacy. It was a move that took many by surprise, an unprecedented step for a member of the British royal family. But for Harry, it was a necessary step, a decision driven by a need to protect the people he loves most from the relentless scrutiny of the British tabloids. Harry's decision was not made lightly. He was acutely aware of the price of fame, having grown up in the shadow of the paparazzi's glare. His childhood was marked by the constant intrusion of the press, their cameras clicking away, stealing moments of privacy and turning them into public spectacle. He witnessed, firsthand, the toll it took on his mother, Princess Diana, how it chipped away at her spirit, leaving her feeling trapped and isolated. In America, Harry saw a chance for a new beginning, an opportunity to escape the toxic environment of the British press and build a life away from the public eye. He was drawn to the promise of privacy, the possibility of raising his children away from the relentless scrutiny that had marked his own upbringing. It was a chance to give his family the normalcy he himself was denied, a chance to put their well-being first. Harry's decision to move to America was also a reflection of his independent spirit, a trait he no doubt inherited from his mother. Like Diana, Harry was not afraid to challenge the status quo, to break away from tradition if it meant finding his own path to happiness. He valued his freedom, his ability to make choices based on his own needs and desires, rather than the expectations of others. 
This decision, while difficult, is an echo of the independent spirit that his mother Diana embodied. It's a testament to his courage, his resilience, and his unwavering commitment to protecting his family's happiness and privacy. What would Diana's reaction have been to Harry's decision? Without a doubt, she would have supported him wholeheartedly. As we delve into the heart of Princess Diana's character, we find a woman of immense compassion, understanding, and a commitment to personal growth. These qualities, firmly rooted in her heart, would have undoubtedly led her to support Harry's decision to move to America. Princess Diana was not one to shy away from the unconventional, nor was she one to prioritize tradition over happiness. She understood all too well the toll the royal life could take, having lived through it herself. It was these experiences that cultivated her deep empathy, enabling her to recognize and understand the struggles faced by her sons under the relentless scrutiny of the British tabloids. So when Harry made the decision to step away from royal life and move across the Atlantic, Diana would have seen the echoes of her own battles in his choice. She would have applauded his courage, his will to break free from the constraints that had once held her captive. She would have admired his strength in prioritizing the happiness and well-being of his family over the expectations of the royal institution. But more than anything, Diana would have celebrated Harry's decision to forge his own path. For it was she who had taught him the importance of authenticity, of being true to oneself regardless of societal pressures. And it was she who had instilled in him the belief that personal growth often requires breaking free from the confines of tradition. And so, as we reflect on Diana's unwavering support, we see a mother who would have stood by her son, understanding his need to escape the toxic environment of the British tabloids, a mother who would have admired his courage in taking control of his life, a mother who would have celebrated his decision to prioritise his family's happiness and privacy. Diana's legacy lives on in Harry's brave decision to forge his own path. As Harry continues to navigate his own journey, he carries with him the values and lessons imparted by his mother, ensuring that Diana's spirit continues to shine brightly in the world. In the end, Princess Diana's legacy is one of authenticity and an independent spirit. Throughout her life, she championed the values of personal freedom, compassion and resilience. These are the very same values we see reflected in her son Harry's decision to carve out a new life in America, away from the relentless gaze of the British tabloids. Let's take a moment to revisit the main points we've covered in this video. We delved into Diana's struggles, her battle for her own freedom from the unyielding scrutiny of the media. We saw how this took a toll on her mental health and well-being, a battle she fought fiercely and bravely. Then we explored Harry's decision to move to America, a decision taken not out of rebellion but out of a need for self-preservation to protect his own mental health and that of his family. A decision that required immense courage and conviction, mirroring his mother's own battles. We then discussed Diana's unwavering support for her son's decisions. Though she is no longer with us, there is little doubt that she would have applauded Harry's courage to break free from tradition, to prioritise his family's happiness and privacy over the expectations of the royal institution. In essence, Diana's legacy is mirrored in Harry's actions. Her spirit of authenticity and independence lives on through her son's bold decisions. It's a testament to Diana's enduring influence, her values passed on to the next generation, her belief in personal freedom echoing in Harry's American dream. As we conclude, remember Diana's legacy, Harry's courage and the importance of personal freedom. These are not just stories of royals, but stories of human resilience of the courage to break free and chart one's own course. Thank you for watching. Don't forget to subscribe, like, and share our content.